Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Outtoos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to collaborate on Wix. But before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. Let's get started. In this case, how do we add collaborators or members that you could basically develop with or in this case in your website? So what we need to do is we first need to access our Wix admin page here. And from here, you want to go to your settings at the bottom left. And from here, you want to go and access the roles and permissions. Now, you need to remember this. Roles and permissions is different from site member settings. So these are two separate uh, settings that you can access. But I want to use these roles and permission option here. Now, from here, you'll have the option to view all the roles. And in this case, uh, the seats that is available right now on your website. Now, for the free plan that I have right now, I can actually add one collaborator for this website. Now, if you want, want to add a new one, you can go and click on Invite Collaborators at the top right here. And you can go and enter their email address here. So just to give an example, let's go and enter this email here. And from here, let's go and click on Add. Now, from here, you want to basically specify the role that you want to give to this user. Now, in this case, the highest permission that you could give here is the co-owner option, which is, uh, in this case, gives them a lot of permissions to do here like edit publish manage site include billing payment and financial info domains and a lot more now, if you want to view more about that permission you can go and click on view role permissions now there are going to be a lot here like manager designer so if you want to give them a specific type of permission you could go and choose that in here but for example let's go ahead and specify this as a website manager now let's go and click on send invites at the top right now, once you've done that, it's going to ask you, let us know uh, how you're connected. So, for example, this is a colleague of mine, and click on done. Now, in this case, what, what the other person need to do here is they need to accept the invitation. So, this is what it's going to look like. So, they should see a Wix.com email here. Let's go ahead and click on it, and they just need to click on accept invite. And it should open up their Wix account here. And let's go ahead and click on accept invite for us to basically accept the invite itself. They might ask you or the client might ask them to log in first. And in this case, they should now be able to access the website. Now, going back to our original account, when we actually uh, visit it again and reload our settings here, it should now show you that this user has accepted the actual invite itself. And they are now a website manager to their, or in this case, in our website. And that's about it. So if I if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.